reflect across the y equals negative 2 axis. All right, usually I reflect over like the x axis or the y axis, but this has me building a brand new mirror. Y equals negative 2 means I'm going to have a horizontal line that goes through negative 2. So let's go to the Y axis, since it's Y equals, let's go to the Y axis and go down to negative 2, there you are, and build my mirror. Now what I'm going to do is reflect this guy up here. The best way to do reflections is now that we have our mirror drawn out, you take each point, each letter, and find out how many spaces our guy is away from the mirror. So Q, for example, is one, two units away from the mirror, which means Q prime is going to appear one, two units away from the mirror. Q prime. All right. I guess that's an X. Maybe, I don't know, maybe it's an L, maybe it's a Z, I can't tell. Let's call it a Z. It looks like a Z now that I look at it closely. So you're a Z now. Z appears to be one, two, three units away. So one, two, three units away, Z prime. I seems to be on the mirror, so don't move it. Okay, that's allowed to happen. And E appears to be one unit away from the mirror, so E prime is going to be one unit away from the mirror. And now the part that I'm always terrible at is drawing this guy out. Oh man, why is it so far away? That's not too bad. That's not too bad either. Maybe I'm finally getting better at this. So there you have it. There it is, there's our reflection. You can see that this guy is completely reflected. Just get some bonus points and get some more time added to this YouTube video so I can get a little bit more money. We're going to list what these four points out in no particular order, I prime. Now, I measure my prime points from the original origin, not from like this green line or anything like that. So my origin is right there. And in order to get to I prime, I go left one, two, three, down one, two. So I prime is left three, negative three, down two, negative two. E prime was start at the origin, go left one, two, three, go down one. So E prime was left three, negative three, down one, negative one. Z is going to be start at the origin, go nowhere left or right and up one. So Z prime is nowhere left or right, up one. So zero, positive one. And Q prime has me starting at the origin and going right one, two. Don't move up or down stays glued to the x-axis. So that's how you reflect across a specific axis. In this case, y equals negative 2 has me take the x-axis, shifting it down 2, but I still see my beautiful little reflection right there. Looks good. I'm sticking with it.